He won the Academy Award for his incredible portrayal of Colonel Hans Lande in Inglorious Bastards. Now he stars in the much anticipated film Water for Elephants. Please welcome Christoph Waltz. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks yeah. for inviting me. Oh, I haven't seen gosh. you, uh, well, since uh, some Academy Award party and also like the GQ party. I remember I saw you there. You were with Quentin Tarantino, and I hadn't seen the movie yet, uh, Inglorious Bastards. And uh, he introduced me to you, and uh, he said if there was a bullseye to hit as far as a great performance goes, you had hit so that true. bullseye. And, I saw the movie immediately afterwards, and I was I was blown, blown away. away. Blown, blown away. Blown away. Terrified. Yeah. Terrified. Do you find people scary? are terrified of you now? Well, you know. I... Do you really like milk? <laughs> no, no. Not, not a huge fan. And you can put a little something into the milk. Okay. <laughs> Spice it up a little. Yeah. The, um, I always say that not to deflect any any praise, which I'm very grateful for. Sure. But it, it needs to be written first. Mm -hmm. Only then you can play it. Right. right. So when when Quentin's talking about bullseye, yes. you know, it's bullseye writing. Bullseye writing. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. He is a master. Yeah. by how actors select their roles. Do you, like, I would think that it would be very difficult to know just by reading the entire script how it will play out in uh, on, on the big yeah, screen. Course, yeah. So well, how do you go about it? No risk, no fun. Um, it's, you know about this as sure. much as I do. Um, um, you, you sort of take a step at a time. Mm -hmm. It's not it's not really mathematical calculation. It's kind of like a living organism that you mm -hmm. start to trust right. and put yourselves into the hands of... Um, a master like Quentin Tarantino. Exactly, mm -hmm. exactly. It's like Quentin will allow the scenes to play and breathe and mm -hmm. give it time. He creates this world yes. for you and you can sort of start living living a different life. Right, right. Really do you think yourself. that you will work with him again in the future? Oh, I yeah. certainly do hope so. I mean, <laughs> it's something that we should ask him more than me. <laughs> Can we get him on the phone? Yeah. <laughs> yes, please. Yeah. I'm on my <laughs> cell phone, yeah. <laughs> Uh, but is, is there some rumor though that uh, yeah there's there, 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 no, there, there, no there's rumor there, it's it's an interesting story how this rumor came about yes. because um, uh, the great Franco Nero the mm -hmm. spaghetti western Franco mm -hmm. Nero yeah. um, wanted to make a spaghetti western in as an homage to uh, Sergio Leone mm -hmm. and he said it would be great to get a director like Quentin Tarantino for it. Yeah. And then some busy blogger mm -hmm. sort of uh, said, oh, Tarantino, yeah, well, you know, Tarantino, last movie, you know, Christopher, well, yeah, okay, well, do you? <laughs> and all of a sudden it I turned into that. the same. Yeah, well, um, let's see. I, yeah. be, I bet it'll see make it happen. happen. Well, Sometimes um, it, all you have to do is put it out there. Yeah, all you happens. need to do is blog. Yes. Well, I don't know. So yeah. now you're in this movie, Water for Elephants, which when it comes out uh, Friday. Friday, 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 yes. Friday, Friday. The most beautiful, visually stunning, and I haven't oh, seen it yet. I've only I saw seen it yesterday. Oh, you saw it yesterday? Yeah, I really oh, did my God. research. Yeah, I know, no, it's great. I saw the movie, I saw the play. I, can't, I said that, that, that Reese Witherspoon's look in this film, I've decided, is going to be my look for the entire summer. I'm going to adapt that look. I'm going to finger wave my hair and the whole thing. Could you send a picture, look. please? I will. I will send you a picture. Yeah. <laughs> Anything you say, I'm really terrified. Yeah. <laughs> and charm. Yeah. I'll send it. Yeah. <laughs> no, this this um, this was extraordinary again. You know, um, and I I couldn't believe my luck. Right. I do this thing. I think, okay, that's a one-off, and you know, maybe whether you deserve it or not mm. is futile to to think about because you don't. So. And um, how long have you been an actor? You've been. Mm -hmm. well, I don't know. 30, and you were raised 30, in, yes. in uh, Vienna? Vienna. Vienna. Yeah, so right. I've been doing this for 30 some years. Right. Well, you've gotten it down to a science now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, We've yeah. got a scene from the movie, and in this scene, uh, Jacob, played by Robert Pattinson, has disobeyed you, and you uh, want him off of your train, your your train, your circus train. Or well, he shouldn't yeah. have disobeyed. That's right. Yes. Play by the we rules. will not disobey you. No. Yes, my 
Isaacus is a sovereign nation. You break my law, you have to pay a penalty. You need to get off the train. Except we don't stop the train. Get off the train! It's not me explaining! No, no, no need! If you took initiative, I respect that. But I'm a law-abiding man. I'll toss him. Wait! 